is hot off the press. Oh, looks good. Simple. Right over here, Grandpa. You fold the flyers. Richard and I will put them into the envelopes. We finished addressing over 300 envelopes. Uh, need another box? Oh, good work, gang. Uh, hi, this is Mike Johnson. Can I speak with Mr. and Mrs. Anderson? Mr. Nelson? Thanks. Hi, this is Robbie Stewart. Did you know my mother is running for the school board? Yes, Miss Kim. Ellen Stewart. She cares. Oh, see you at the polls. Certainly. I'll give you your best wishes, Mr. Nelson. Yeah, hi, this is Mike Johnson. Can I speak with Mr. and Mrs. Burns? Thank you. We have done so much in such a short amount of time, I can't believe it. Wait till Philip comes home and sees our progress. <laughs> Everyone saw the story in the Riverdale newspaper. Mr. Maxwell was very kind to print my announcement. Well, it helps enormously. Everybody in Riverdale reads his paper. <clears throat> Your photo in it helped, too. Thanks to you, Richard, it's a good picture. Well, hi, all. Hi, Hello, now. darling. Hi. Yeah, may, I, uh, may I help? Mm-hmm. Licking envelopes. I fold the flyers. We stuff them. And I lick the envelopes. <laughs> hmm. Hey, everybody, Mrs. Greenberg is on the phone. She says Carter Boswell is on the TV right now, doing a commercial. Oh, uh, what channel? Five. Five? And if you ask what I care about, I'll tell you. I care about the school buildings in need of paint. I care about more lockers for the teachers. I care about new fixtures in the hallways. Not music or dancing or entertainment. I care about the practical things. If you do, vote for me, Carter Boswell. A lot of people will agree with him. I told you. Too bad kids can't vote. It's our school, but we can't vote. There are people in favor of the cultural programs, Mom. There are, Ellen. Don't be upset by Boswell's commercial. You have to go on television, too. Oh, Boswell's a powerful speaker. Well, you can be, too. Your ideas are good ones. I don't know. I'm not sure I'm up to it. <laughs>